What's up guys, John here, Titan Talk Tuesday, and today's a special Tuesday. Why? It's one of the biggest days of the year. The election is here. So at that point, it's a big, big day in our country, in the United States. Uh, before we start getting talking about that, we got some other things going on. How are you guys doing? Thank you guys for joining in. Got a great show for you guys. We're going to talk about Therapy of the Week today. Some important people have died over this weekend, which sucks. Uh, T-cell study. We're going to talk about T-cell study and immunity with COVID. Um, and we're also going to talk about getting out to vote for you guys, right? So let's talk about it. So let's get into Titan Talk Tuesday with no further ado. First thing we're going to talk about today is the therapy of the week. Therapy of the week this week is a big, big patient favorite and one of my favorites um, other than HRT. And it's Hercules Potion. So if you guys don't know what Hercules Potion is or maybe you guys have heard me talk about it but don't know what it is, let's talk about Hercules Potion and what it is and how it can help you guys because that's why you guys are here, right? You guys want to find out some more information, especially on the therapies, what's going to help you, why it's going to help you, and what's in it. That's good questions. How much it costs. If you guys have any questions along the way, please shoot them out. So, let's talk about Hercules Potion. Hercules Potion is awesome. And the reason is, is because anybody can really use it. Girls can use it. Guys can use it. You know, we only service 21 and up. So, anybody 21 and up can use it. There's multiple benefits for Hercus Potion and the ways you can use it and what it's going to provide you after you do use it. So let's get into it. So what's in Hercules Potion? That's usually the first thing. People ask me or I get a question on Instagram or Facebook and people don't know our therapies, don't know about Titan Medical Center and say, hey, John, what is Hercules Potion or what is that? So Hercules Potion is a doctor prescribed custom signature injectable of amino acids that just Titan Medical Center offers its patients. So you can't get Hercules Potion anywhere else, okay? That's what one thing that differentiates Titan Medical Center to everybody else out there. So, what's in it? Well, we talked about it being a doctor-prescribed injectable amino acid blend. It has glutamine, arginine, ornithine, lysine, L-citrulline, uh, proline, taurine, NAC, and L-carnitine. So, it has nine different ingredients for you guys. Nine different amino acids that are going to help you guys in a multitude of different ways. Now let's talk about what happens when you inject Hercules Potion and how it's going to benefit you. First off, glutamine. Glutamine is in almost every supplement you see out there over the counter. We know glutamine, or a lot of people do, for recovery. That's what glutamine is going to do for you guys in Hercules Potion immediate gratification so the first thing you're going to feel right off the bat what's up Chaz Law how you doing what's up guys thank you for joining so what's in it right off the bat that you're going to feel you're going to feel arginine and L-citrulline okay these are the instant gratification amino acids that you're going to tell right away or get an effect from within 30 minutes of injecting Hercules potion now what are those what do those things do arginine and L-citrulline are vasodilators they're precursors to nitric oxide and what does that do that opens up your blood vessels which will let you get blood flowing a lot faster and take a lot more oxygen to the muscles it will also inc increase your pump so a lot of people take pre-workouts these different things out there for pump factor they want to feel a pump and i think everybody does right especially if you're in there working in the gym so some of these different things people take they get a really minor pump from it right they get maybe 15, 20 minutes right when they get out of the gym, and then it's gone and done. Well, that sucks, okay? I'm just telling you. With Hercules Potion, the original citrulline in there, your pump will probably last about four to six hours, and it will come on strong and fast. I'm talking about usually within the first two sets is when I really feel it the most. It starts getting in, and this just starts getting out of control pump, which is great because you know you're, you're pushing blood into that muscle, you're breaking down that muscle, the fascia is stretching, the tissue. So that's a good thing for you, right? And that's just three different ingredients we're talking about here. Glutamine for recovery, arginine citrulline for pump factor, vasodilation, and blood flow. Now let's get into ornithine. Ornithine is one of my favorites in there too. And it goes right along with everything that's in there. All these ingredients work systemically or systematically together. Now, 
Ornithine is an anti-fatigue amino acid, right? So what it's going to do is it's going to help you, as far as that goes, do more strenuous activity or longer workouts or whatever the activity is, whether it's hiking, whether it's running, right? Whether it's bedroom activity, this will help you go longer and it should help you do more reps if you're working out. And at that point, you should get a better result because you're putting in more effort, right? You're putting in more work in. So you should hopefully get more out. All right, question here right before we go on. My neck is looking saggy. Is that just a fat injectable that you can be put in anywhere? Uh, then it'll tighten my neck. Or do you have to put a fat injectable in there and then use some kind of machine to tighten your neck? All right, so this is not something you're going to want to inject in your neck. You can inject this in any muscle in the body from calves, traps, uh, deltoids, which are shoulders, pecs, chest, uh, glutes. Women uh, do a lot to pump the rump. Calves, you know, for some certain people, uh, legs, but don't inject in your neck, okay? That's it's getting kind of close to different things. Plus, you're not going to have a muscle inject in there. I would really look at the fat burning cream. Um, that's more of a tightening cream um, that will shrink fat cells in the area, so it will give it a more aesthetically pleasing look if that's what you're looking for, okay? Uh, I hope that will help. If you guys have any questions about that or anything else we're talking about, you guys can always call 727 or text 727-389-3220. So back to Hercules Potion. So we talked about glutamine. We talked about arginine. We talked about citrulline. We talked about ornithine. Now we're talking about lysine. So lysine's in it too as well. What does lysine do? So lysine is great for building the immune system, boosting the immune system. And when you're working out or doing strenuous activity, you're putting stress on the body, which will cause stress on the immune system too as well. Um, at that point, you want to boost it up as much as possible. Now, it's healthy to put some of the stress on your body, but you want to make sure your body's not overstressed, okay? NAC, and acetylcysteine. This point, this works with liver functions. So helping the liver work better, helping it process fats faster, helping it be less toxic, okay? And this is not a toxic injection, but we want to make sure you guys are getting overall benefits. Next one, proline. So bro proline is a collagen-based amino acid. So it's great for shoulders, uh, lubricating joint areas. That's what it's in there for. L-carnitine, weight loss, blood flow, taurine, brain function, cramping. These nine components working together should hopefully help you with better activity, strenuous activity, helping recover from more strenuous activity, helping boost the immune system, vital organs, lubricating the joint, and help you out with weight loss and cramping. So there's a lot of different benefits you're going to get from Hercules Potion, not just the pump. Everybody focuses in on the pump. Even the girls sometimes, they call it a pre-workout. It's not really a pre-workout because there's not really stimulants in it. The reason they say it's a pre-workout is because they usually take it right before their workouts. And like I said, the first thing you notice is the arginine citrulline. And I've had a lot of people naysayers before, and they've tried it. I just seen a text message today. And the guy said, I was kind of on the edge about this Hercules Potion. I am a firm believer after using it the first time. And that's why it's so successful. You know, all, everybody that takes it usually raves about it. Big Drew's up on here. I know me and him take it a lot. But all the athletes, regular people that are training, people that are trying to get better mind-to-muscle contractions, um, they're trying to get that connection, mind to muscle connection, so they can get better contractions. They can feel blood flowing in there. This will help that. This will also help catching up lagging body parts. Some people have gotten into accidents. I can name one example where a guy got in a motorcycle accident. One leg was littered than the other. He was trying to get the leg and get the muscle reactivated as best as possible and keep it up to the other leg because it did lose some size. Being in a cast and such, you will lose some size and you have to work extra hard and you have to go through some extra pain possibly. So this definitely helped the patient get his leg back up to the other leg in size because he wanted to be, you know, he wanted to be symmetrically almost perfect, okay? And, and he was. So at that point, he got back. What up, Big Gino, my man? What up, Victor? How you doing? Jay Petri, CeeLo, Tony, how you guys doing? Thank you guys for joining Titan Talk Tuesday. Every Tuesday, 6 p.m., just for you guys. Ilmag, what's going on, man? Ilmag sent us some videos and tagged us in them. He, he was doing some some pull-ups and stuff like that with the Noel Turner shirt. Big ups, and I see everything, guys, so please tag us. I'm watching. I'm on social media looking. I appreciate it. If you guys are patients out there, girls, guys, please 
Call or text in. I'll send you out a free tank top or shirt for you guys, all right? What up, Chris? How you doing, man? So Hercules Potion Therapy of the Week. If you're looking for better recovery, better pumps, right? Long-lasting pumps. Longer workouts or strenuous activity. Boosting the immune system. Liver functions, right? Helping you guys with more blood flow and cramping. Hercules Potion is the injectable therapy for you guys. Only amino acids, no hormones, no stimulants. These are things your body needs to function properly and function optimally. So you guys will love it, right? What's up? My Hercules Potion comes in this week. It's my first time using it. Hulk Squad, I want to know when you get it. I want to know when you inject it and what your feeling was after it. Okay, I love to hear the response from people. If you have any questions on how to use any of our therapies, if you do get them, um, you guys can call or text us at any point in time. If there's a problem, issue, question, concern, we're here for you guys. So let the medical staff, the medical assistants, the medical providers take care of you guys properly, okay? All right, so let me know on that, all right? All right, so so does this mean whatever muscle you inject it to that will potentially become larger and stronger? Um, so what it does is it, it will it will definitely help muscles become larger and stronger. Now, when you inject it, let's say you don't want to spot inject Hercules Potion because you don't have to spot inject it, but you can. If you said, you know what, that's not for me, I just want to inject it the easiest place possible, you can inject it right in your shoulder in your deltoid, right? It's with a little insulin needle, right? You inject that, it's going to work systemically through the body. So it's going to work, at, work through the whole entire body. But if you want more instant gratification, that is where the spot injecting comes into play. And you will get more of an instant gratification. So for people that really do want to try to help the certain areas, they might inject in those different areas and work out that muscle a little bit harder, a little bit longer to try to catch the muscle up to the other side. All right. All right, so what else we got? Keep tight. What's going on, man? How you guys doing? We got a whole conversation going on up here. Oh, wow. We got a lot of people. Okay, all right. So Big Drew, Mind and Muscle Connection for sure. Dwayne Day loves the Hercules Potion. Yes, Dwayne, what do you like best about the Hercules? Way better pumps. There's no crash. All right, so we got that. Took Hercules Potion for a long time. Then I wanted to see how my workouts and my pump were probably without it. Uh, and I guarantee it's once you do it, it, there's no going back to that feeling. It's the best. And it's not, you know, it's not hurting you in any way, shape, or form. It just provides a level of uh, performance for you guys um, that, that will definitely help. And you will definitely notice, which is awesome. That's what you want to know. Key Titan said, ECA stack, Hercules before my workouts. It's changed my life about three years ago. We'll never not have it. Keith knows. ECA stack plus and Hercules potion, those two. That, that's you know that that's going together like peanut butter and jelly. Dwayne Day, yeah, I took the potion for a long time, and I want to see how my workouts would be after I stopped taking it, and my workouts sucked. Sorry for that, but listen, Hercules Potion is going to get you back up, Dwayne. I promise you, man. And I see you putting in that work on there, too, so keep it up. All right, just took mine. Half an ml in each delt. Time to kill it. Talk to you later, bro. Of course, happy belated birthday. All right, All right Big Gino, good. Go kill it, brother. I love it. Chris, what's your question, man? Shoot it out to me, all right? And let's move on a little bit. All right, so the next thing, get out and vote. So please, guys, if you guys have not voted yet, you guys are in the state of Florida, I believe you guys got till 7 or 8. I'm going to actually have to rush off this and go over there and vote myself. I meant to vote today, earlier today, and I went down to the polls here in Tampa, right by my office, which is real close by the aquarium, um, and I'm not... I don't live in this county. My business is in, in Hillsboro, but I don't live in this county. So they told me I had to go to my county to vote. Now, the thing about this is, uh, I put my question in question section. All right, where is it at? I did not see it, Chris. I'm looking for it. Uh, I'll look for it one second. So I went down there. I went to, to go vote, right? And at that point, they told me, like, listen, you can't vote here. You don't live in this county. I'm like, oh, well, that sucks. They're like, I'm like, what's the reason behind that? And they said, well, you know, because you want to uh, vote for your local officials. Now, I totally understand that. All right, you got to vote for your local officials, and that's in your county, county commissioner, and all that good stuff that goes along with it. But nationally, for the presidency, I think you should be able to vote anywhere. Why are you just segregated to vote in one area? I, I don't know why that is. So they should change that. I don't know why. All right, I'll type it again. Yes, Chris, please put it out there for me one more time, and I'll definitely answer your question for you, okay? So, guys, please go vote. 
And listen, if your family or friends are voting for somebody that you don't know or you don't like or whatever it is, don't get in their butt about it. That's their choice. That's their right. That's their decision. I don't care who else somebody else votes for. As long as they vote. Then we know that everybody's, you know, what, what their decision is is out there. What they want to do is out there. And they've made some sort of, you know, um, they made some sort of effort to try to change what's going on around them, right? And, guys, no violence, none of that, please. I mean, listen, I have what I want to do again. And at that point, I don't really know what other people want to do, but please. The three things, I was talking about this earlier, that my dad taught me not to talk about was religion, right? Was politics and was sex. So at that point, I'm not doing it. It helps to prevent voter fraud easier to track per person. I agree. I agree. So cost, Krilla, it does. It's, uh, do you eat a lot of trail mix and nuts? No, I don't. <laughs> I don't eat a lot of trail mix and nuts. I eat a lot of chicken, a little white, white rice, uh, you know, steak, uh, filet, I try to get the leanest cut possible, some potatoes, possible little pasta here or there. All right, so Chris, I still did not see it. It says sent. I'll type it again. It says sent. Are we seeing a question from Chris out there? Chris. Yeah. Chris, I'm not seeing the question pop up, man. All right, so I'm going to keep moving on here. All right, so go vote. Go have your voice heard or at least go make an effort. All right, so the next thing. This is really cool. T-cell studies adds debate over duration of COVID-19 immunity. So if you guys have got COVID out there, I've got COVID before. Uh, I got it in June, like right in the middle of June. And at that point, I, I was totally asymptomatic. Sharice got it real bad. Um, and at that point, she was in ICU for a little bit, and she dealt with it for a long time. I think she's finally over it. Knock on wood. Hopefully, you know. She went through a lot of stuff, so hopefully she is over it or past it. Now, next thing came immunity. So antibody testing. We started antibody testing for blood. My big thing was, was that I wanted to test antibodies and see how long it actually lasted in my body and how long it actually lasted in Sharice's body. Because I was totally asymptomatic. She was really sick, so she must have had a bigger viral load possibly of COVID-19. Um, so at that point, we checked. And we checked every month until... October, right, basically. I didn't have the antibodies last week. Cherie still has them. So that was a big thing. So now I'm like, man, I'm like, I hope I don't get reinfected with this, right? I don't want to get reinfected with COVID-19 because I was totally asymptomatic before. I don't want to take it back to anybody, get anybody else sick. My dad's high risk. You know, I don't want Peter to possibly get it again because he had it. So I started reading up on these studies. And the studies are saying that basically, even if the antibodies go away, and that, that, that's what they say or usually happens to asymptomatic people or people that had mild symptoms. Usually antibodies decrease a lot faster and go away. But then we start talking about T-cell immunity. So if you guys don't know what T-cells are, there's two types of T-cells. There's killer cells and there's helper cells. These T-cells track down viruses and all these bad cells in the body and go attack them. Then the helper cells come behind them and basically help and recover these cells. They take basically these photo prints of these different viruses. So once they beat them out, if they ever try to come back in the body, they recognize them, they know them, they eradicate them, and they give you an immune defense. So at that point, this is what they're talking about here. They're talking about up to six months of defense, possibly, or more, with T-cell immunity. Now, there's no really way to test this except for you're in a lab and they start doing testing on patients. But it leads me into the next thing of thymosin alpha-1. Thymosin alpha-1 augments or increases T-cell production in the body. Now, I'm not talking about COVID, and I'm not saying this is a COVID cure or anything like that. But what I'm talking about doing is building your immune defense and immune system the strongest as possible. Think about it. If you were going into war, would you not want to have any the best weapons with you? Would you go in weaponless? You go into war against... 20 people that have automatic machine guns you have a knife and a stick wouldn't you want to go in with a, with a, an automatic machine gun a rocket launcher a tank possibly something that you know is going to give you a stronger or better way to win and this is what thymosin alpha one does for the body it helps t-cell augmentation and increases this t-cells so they can go through the body and they can actually help you raise your defense for immunities against everything out there from viruses to bacterial infections so talking about it thymosin alpha one but the big thing here was immunity 
to COVID-19. And that comes from the body after you possibly catch it. We don't know how long. And I don't want to be uh, the example for this at all either. But at this point, we will get these. We will get more studies because they're studying this more and more, obviously, with the pandemic going on. All right. So vitamin D3, that's a big one. That's a really good one. All right. All right. Lindsay's on here. Lindsay should tell you guys what Hercules Potion is because it's Therapy of the Week and she works here. I got anabolics, Chris. Magna. What up, Antonio? Dave Chris says Trump. All right. Migraine meds. Take four a set. What? Do you have any anabolics? Also, do you have anything for chronic migraines? Because working out sometimes makes them worse since I have them three to four times a week. Okay. So anabolics. So when we talk about anabolics, I was going to save this one for next week. But we talk about anabolic steroids. And anabolic steroids get a bad rap. And anabolic steroids are actually in everybody's body. Males, females, we automatically have anabolic steroids. You have them. So if somebody says, do you have anabolic steroids? I don't want to take anabolic steroids. I don't need it. I don't, I don't want it. You have anabolic steroids in your body. Let's talk about these. Anabolic steroids or androgens. So masculine hormones, talking about testosterone. So Chris, testosterone is one anabolic steroid. That's in males and females. Now these aren't at super physiological levels. These are at normal levels. And normal levels for a guy can really fluctuate from 264 to 946, and that's a really big range. So if, if, if you know if you're looking for certain things like that, we can probably help you out with it if you need it. There's other anabolics out there um, that we do do in certain circumstances for patients. Just depends. Um, and now, if you have any chronic chronic migraines, excuse me, if you're taking anabolics or any androgens, you better make sure that you're donating blood or at least checking your complete blood cell count, or CBC. The reason is, if you take androgens or anabolic steroids, this can thicken the blood. This can raise hemoglobin, hematocrit, red blood cell count. When this happens, right, it starts getting thicker. Your blood starts getting thicker. It can get sludge-like. At that point, will not move as easy and can actually cause your stroke, DVT, blood clots. And after you get these things, what happens? You go on blood thinners. This is not good. And you might have to be on those blood thinners for a long, long time. And then after that, medical providers are really not going to want to give you any anabolic steroids or testosterone replacement therapy or hormone replacement therapy. They're really going to look at it very closely. And if they don't, I would definitely watch out for who they are and providing medical services for you, okay? Because it can be very serious and it can cause more and more problems for you, okay? Need HGH. Sorry, we don't do any HGH, but we do have peptides like growth hormone releasing peptides, CJC with Imperellin. We have MK677, which is an oral GHRH, growth hormone releasing peptide. Um, we also have IGF-1 LR3. So it's about a third of the, cro of the cost of HGH, and it's going to work very, very well. All right, so uh, Creel Fell, are you personally taking fish oil or sardines? Sardines, I think, is what she's saying. So I don't take fish oils in. I do eat fish. Um, you know, there are a couple um, fish oils on the market prescribed, actually. There's one, Vasipa. Um, and if you look at that, fish oil and it's the only prescribed FDA approved fish oil which is it's kind of crazy and that's how they market it but if you look at that capsule compared to any other fish oil capsule on the market over the counter it's night and day the Vasipa capsule is totally clear like like water liquid clear and the fish oil you get from over the counter is like yellowish right I mean when you put them together man it's like it's night and day difference you will be like oh wow that is different than that one it's that big uh, of the difference in, in look and in effect too. Now think about this, to have an FDA approved drug and not all FDA approved drugs are good. There, there's negative side effects, right? But to have this, you have to have clinical trials done. It has to prove that this does work in that way, shape or form, which is really cool. Um, so that's, that's a good one. Vitamin D3 is very important though. And now definitely raise a vitamin D concern. Vi most people are vitamin D deficient are low on vitamin D, and this can have a direct effect on immunity, uh, renal, so kidneys, um, testosterone, and a lot of different things. So people call it vitamin D. Everybody, it's vitamin D, right? Well, vitamin D is actually a hormone. 
Okay, so it's not really a vitamin. All right, how does that help with muscle gain and losing fat? All right, so if you want help with muscle gain and losing fat, first, make sure your hormone levels are right, optimally intact, okay? That way, think of yourself like a race car. Everything is dialed in. Everything is test and tuned. Next thing, obviously, nutrition, okay? Activity, sleep are going to go along with your foundations. And then when you want to add in and, and start getting more boost or expedite some of these results you're looking for, Chris, ECA Stack Plus. If you're looking for weight loss, you're looking for energy, concentration, definitely the best on the market prescribed. That's the only way you can get real ephedrine prescribed. There's different doses for different patients because everybody's different. Some people have more sensitivities to stimulants than other people do. So ECA Stack Plus for sure. And then after that, you can add in Hercules Potion. That will definitely help with some muscle gain too as well. Definitely get blood work. Big Drew hit it right on the head. Do not guess. Do not self-diagnose. Don't be Dr. Google. Blood test. See what your levels are at. Make educated decisions. You can do this now. It's not out of the out of like you know it's not out, out of play where you can't go in and get these blood tests done through us nationwide service whatever we do from hormone replacement therapy to blood work to vitamin amino acid injectable therapies like hercules potion um rejuvenation detox glutathione for liver functions organ functions peptides from healing peptides like bpc 157 tb 500 to growth from releasing hormone and peptides like CJC-1295 with Perone or MK-677. Even weight loss peptides like AOD-9604, right? AOD stands for Advanced Obesity Drug, AOD. Beer is a blood thinner. All right, so yes, alcohol can thin the blood, yes. But you don't want to drink a lot of alcohol. One, it will age you prematurely if you drink too much. Two, it's bad for the immune system. Three, it slows down muscle synthesis. So when you go work out, right, your muscles are going through muscle synthesis, they're going to build back up and stuff like that. When you actually drink alcohol, you will you will negate this process a little bit, right? It could hurt this muscle synthesis process and you gaining bigger, leaner muscle. So you guys wanna do that. What up, Greg, what's up, man? All right, the same testosterone that was deemed bad to take 15 years ago is now prescribed to most men 40 and regular. So yes, now you gotta look at it like this, right? So it, it does suck, okay? but the reason is, is this, is when lawmakers started seeing um, other countries and, and the abuse of steroids, okay, and that's what testosterone is, anabolic steroid. We have it in our bodies, females have it in our bodies, but, you know, it, it just got a bad, it, it got, it, man, it got a bad name. It got stereotyped, it got a black eye, right? They were thinking, oh, this is bad for people, this is going to hurt their heart, this is going to hurt their sugar levels. This is going to hurt all these different things, prostate and all this. Now they're finding out that testosterone is actually good for cardiovascular. It's good for sugar levels. It's good for all these different things they said no to. And think about it. This really does make sense. We have it in our bodies. As long as you're not taking super physiological doses of this, right, not going extreme, you're going to be great. You're going to be optimal. When you were the youngest as a male, you had the highest levels of testosterone at that point. And think about it. You're the healthiest usually at that point too. It's when we get older and decline in hormones and all these different things where these health conditions actually come on stronger. And the older we get, it's like we wither and we start dying. More things are going to happen. More things are going to break down. And it's a domino effect from there. So think about it. We want to really turn back the clock on the inside to really help the outside. All right? So, and they're wrong. And, and more people know Hawk Squad than you know now. And when I got into this nine years ago, you should have really seen the stigma about testosterone. Man, it has gotten so much more uh, accepted out in the public with males, females, all this. All yeah, all the studies have been coming out. So there's a lot of good things that have come along with it. So I really fought for nine years. And at this point, I really do see, you know, there is an opening at the end of the tunnel uh, for this and helping a lot of people because, you know, a lot of people are affected by their hormones, whether they like they know it or not, you know, where they want to admit it or not. They are. All right. So MK677. Yep. It's a good one. Can you get me M677 to stop? Yeah. So and now 
MK677, you don't need blood work for. You have to fill out the new patient paperwork. You'll see the medical provider. If you're not here in Florida, via telemedicine, by either uh, FaceTime, if you have an Apple product, or Skype, if you don't, and you guys can get that. Testosterone replacement is the only thing you will need blood work for, hormones. So at that point, um, you can get that done too. We can set you up with a lab in your area. We send you a slip. Um, it's all paid for at that point. You go in, give them the slip, they draw your blood. We got your results in three to four business days. Now listen, you can either take those results, look at them, take them somewhere else, or we can set you up with a medical consultation and we can help you out with the therapies and they get sent directly to your house from the pharmacy, not from Titan Medical Center, okay? All right, so yeah, that's just another one for you guys. What up, Stacy? Yep, Hawk Squad 45. So 45, man, so you're right around that age. We tell everybody usually at 30 to start checking. I've seen 21 year olds that have not taken any anabolic steroids, no abuse to their body whatsoever, eat great, and still have really, really low levels. Now, that could be from genetics, that could be from environment, toxins we're taking in. You know, it is what it is. Top three sellers. All right, Dave. All right, so HRT excluded. All right, top three in my mind. This is a hard one. And it really does, it really, it matters what you're trying to go after. Now, for me, I'm always going to say Hercules Potion. I'm always going to see ECA Sac Plus. Now, I can switch a couple in and out of here, right? Now, if I wanted to, maybe Titan Complete, those right there, the trifecta. The trifecta. All right, there's a reason that's a trifecta. You can use them all on the same day. They all go together and all have different components that are going to help you be great, work out optimally, and feel the best, okay? Now, there's a couple that you can switch in and out of here. The NAD, concentration, focus, driven. It helps on a cellular level for repair. So it helps the body repair and cellular level. That's huge. So NAD is another big one. Now, if you're talking about, hey, listen, I'm hurt. My elbow, my shoulder, this, that. That's where BPC and TB500 come into play. But currently, I would have to say Hercules Potion, ECA Stack Plus, and you know, I love my Titan Complete, but my NAD is definitely getting me through the day. So I would definitely look at those three if you're looking to do that. Did see anabolic bulking worlds and go with MK607, better for gains. You guys need to listen to Drew. Drew's bigger than all you guys. He's done it all, right? He's been through this. He's tried these, these different things. He will tell you his honest opinion. That's one thing about Drew I love. He'll give it to you straight and truthful, whether you like it or not. So big time. So NAD is better than glutathione? Different. Okay. Now glutathione, that's another one. And so it's hard, right? It's hard. So if you ask me, hey, John, you know, what's going to be best for like inflammation in the body? What's going to be like a super antioxidant in the body? What's going to help with liver functions in the body? Uh, what's going to help me possibly feel better or get over getting sick faster? That's where glutathione comes into play. For me, you know, I see, I like glutathione too. So, I mean, I take all these things. I take like 10 injections a day. And I know that's not, uh, you know, that's not what everybody can do out there, right? So I understand that too. So I try to, I'm trying to put myself in your shoes. But like I said, really, we really cater the regiments to what the person is trying to do, the goals they're trying to, to achieve. Because one month or two months, it could be one thing. The next time after that, it could be a totally different goal or something you're trying to achieve or something comes back in the blood test, like high liver functions, and then you switch one out, right? And then you get the benefits of that therapy. And you can switch one out the next month, right? Instead of just doing the exact same thing over and over and over. Now listen, Hercules Potion, ECA Stack Plus, don't take away from me, okay? ECA has run my day. I don't take any energy drinks, no coffee, nothing like that. So it's just one ECA usually in the daytime, and I'm rock and rolling all day. Hercules Potion, man, I'll tell you, there ain't nothing like it. I'm telling you, I, I tell this to everybody, and I don't like to pump it up that much, but it is what it is. And when people try it, they usually come back to me and say, man, that is off the hook. I'm not trained or I'm not doing any physical activity without it and that's from a lot of things don't just think about the gym it's not just about lifting weights this could be cardiovascular exercises this could be you walking around disney or universal all day or outside all day or hiking all day you running sprints all day you doing a practice of some sort of activity okay this can help in that many ways plus the arginine citrulline are great and let me tell you why because not only are they going to help you with the pump, but they're also going to help with blood flow down low. So at that point, you should have 
better erections, um, more fulfilling erections as far as that goes. Blood flow should be good, nice, and strong. Okay, so that's another benefit to it. All right, so Imperellin and CJC twelve ninety five safety. So they're pretty. The safety protocol is pretty good on them um, as far as that goes. Now those are two different peptides in one di one therapy that we offer. Great as far as stimulating the pituitary naturally to produce your own growth hormone. That's a plus. You know where. You know, if somebody does take growth hormone, real growth hormone, you're, they're shooting it in, and they're possibly going to shut down their own pituitary or um, or them being able to get their own growth hormone, basically. Shutting down their natural function and not producing it, okay? So that's the big thing. That's the good thing about CJC-1295 and, and Imperellin. It's going to naturally, the pulses are going to stimulate posterior and anterior of the pituitary to help you produce your own natural growth hormone levels and not synthetically. So that's that's definitely a good one. All right, so can you stay on IGF-1 on a 3 for multiple months or should you take some time off? So you should only be on it for so long. And then you should take at least 30 days off when the body reset, right? Um, you know, at that point, not, you know, not getting, you know... Um, desensitized at that point, and then you can start it back up. But you should take some time in between there, yes. And we can walk you through that if you have questions on that, all right? Okay, so Sean Connery is gone, man. I read this uh, over the weekend, 90 years old. I was definitely, you know, it definitely it sucked reading this. You know, 2020 has been a horrible year. You know, with, there's been a lot of big celebrity deaths and stuff like that. Uh, and Sean Connery, to me, was a man's man. That was a testosterone-bearing man, okay? This guy is not like a snowflake that we see today sometimes. This guy was a serious alpha male. He was a gentleman, right? He even got knighted by the Queen of England, right? This guy was James Bond. James Bond, all right? There's only so many people that played James Bond. This guy played James Bond to a T, you know? It's just, it's, it's, it's sad, to see this guy go and the way he did so sean connery if you don't know died of dementia 90 years old so at least he lived a long time but dementia took him out his wife said it was one of the most horrible diseases that she's ever seen as far as degrading her husband um him diminishing all the way around from physically to mentally so so it sucked um you know was there a couple other great movies like the rock i mean that was a good one with nicholas cage disney movie you know if you haven't seen the movie, it's a classic and a lot of other movies. Indiana Jones. I mean, there was a lot of movies that Sean Connery was in. So, uh, big shout to Sean Connery. And it sucks. Dementia. It affects a lot of people out there. Um, and dementia. Another good one. We were talking about dementia. NAD. Dementia and Alzheimer's are actually treated with NAD treatments, too. Um, it actually helps with the cellular repair, especially in the brain. And that's where dementia and Alzheimer's start attacking. So, if you guys want to check it out, check it out. Are you are your vitamins subcutaneous or intermuscular? So you can shoot most of them subcutaneous. I would shoot them intermuscular. Um, you can really do it either way, preference wise. Uh, you do it with a thirty gauge half inch needle, uh, so it's an insulin needle. So you could do it uh, subcutaneous, but most of them I do intermuscular. Okay, so it's really upon the person and their preference of what's going on. What's the lowest ECA dose that's offered at Titan? Lowest ECA dose is twelve point pot twelve. 0.5 milligrams of ephedrine. It's got uh, 100 milligrams of caffeine. It's got 30 milligrams of aspirin in it. It's got 1,000 micrograms of chromium. And it's got 1,000 micrograms of methyl B12. That's the lowest dose that we have at Titan Medical Center. Um, and that dose, like, for me, it wouldn't even affect me. Like, if I took that, I'd probably yell at, at the staff. I'm like, what was in this? This was sugar. I, I didn't feel anything out of it. Okay, I need a little bit of a higher dose. But for like Sharice, who's very sensitive to stimulants, she takes a low dose and then it works for her well. I've seen bikini models take two high doses a day and it worked great for them. And I've seen a guy about Drew's size take a high dose and say, oh, I, I think I might need to sit down. Now, the whole point is, is to get a great effect energy-wise, concentration-wise, and start burning fat. You don't need negative symptoms, heart palpitations, jitters, um, bouncing off walls, nauseous. You don't want these. I know a lot of people, and I, I used to take it too. NO Explode was a big one I used to take back in the day. I think a lot of people did. But NO Explode used to make my stomach get put on blast. And I had to go to the bathroom before I started training. And I didn't feel right or I felt like 
too jittery. Like, you know, you just feel too jittery. Oh, this pre-workout's great. You think, oh, this is how it's supposed to feel. It's not supposed to feel like that. You're not supposed to go overboard like that. Um, and basically, you can overdose on caffeine. That's where you start feeling the negative effects, like nauseous and stuff like that as well. So, big shout out to Sean Connery and his family. We've lost a good one. Um, T-cell immunity. Make sure you guys check into that. Thymosin alpha-1 if you're looking for something to increase that as well. Ephedrin, ephedra. There's two different ones. Uh, and then therapy of the week, Hercules Potion. So Hercules Potion, therapy of the week. Listen, the blood work special is still in effect. I haven't posted it yet, but I've been letting people that call in tell them, hey, listen, I want to get the blood work special still. And if you guys do that, you guys will get the d discount on blood work, okay? So blood work special, 130 for males, full panel, 200 for females. So take advantage of it. What does a normal plan cost? Is this talking about HRT? For guys, it could be between 200 and 375 per month. That includes, includes their estrogen blockers, testosterone, ACG, their syringes, medical reviews, shipping, all packaged, all out to you guys, all right? For women, it starts about 100, okay? Um, so those are HRT packages. All right, upcoming events. So if you guys didn't check out the stories from this weekend, it was Halloween Saturday, right? So I want to go over this because we had two different events on Saturday, Halloween day. First one, we were down in Orlando. We had the Mid-Florida Classic 25-year anniversary. Deke Warner, Titan Medical Center presented that show, and uh, we judged a costume contest. Great time. A lot of competitors. Big shout-out to Deke Warner for putting on such a great event, especially with all this crazy COVID and all the garbage of replaying this event for another day it sucked but it was a great show seamless went awesome after that we left and we went straight to tampa we had the vampires ball which we're a main title sponsor to as well at the cuban club put on by pied piper productions big shout out to mike piper core arena and the whole crew it was a great time we had a stage table up there we had some of the titan team and family come out we hung up uh, hung out up there had some drinks kind of relaxed uh and had our costumes on and we killed it everybody loved our costumes we had really authentic and i think the theme of that night especially for titan was captain america me big drew sharice amanda which is drew's girl uh even eva came up there so we had five different types of captain americas and it was just fitting i think and the reason was was because god bless america all right this is our country i don't i think some people have lost sight of that they don't have pride in our country in the united states of america they're ashamed of our national anthem uh you know when i when i hear that national anthem when i heard that this saturday at the mid florida classic deke had a girl and she sung it live and it was beautiful it always brings chills to my skin hearing the national anthem right holding my hand over my chest and thinking about all the brave people out there that fought and died for our country our freedoms and where we're at today now, a lot of people out there that i see or i think they have lost total sight of this they have no idea what the hell they're talking about or I, I they're just lost like what are we talking about here you guys want to burn the united states flag you want to just take this you guys want to disrespect our country well, that's not the United States that I know up and I grew up in. So hopefully we do well, all right? Did I pick the winner of the costume contest online? So I'm glad you brought this up, Hulk Squad. So we did not. And the reason was is I didn't get a lot of tags in the costume contest. I'll give you guys a couple more days. If you guys are online, you might win. So at that point, you need to tag Titan Medical, the page on Instagram, at Titan Medical or Facebook, at Titan Medical Center and with your costume and let me see what it is. At that point, we'll pick a winner. There was a couple that, that, that came in, but I wanted to make sure there was more uh, more people. So at that point, I gave it a fair chance. All right. High androgens give me anxiety. Oxandrolone, do you all formulate? So, yes, yeah, so we have Oxandrolone for some patients. We have Nandrolone for some patients. Now, you're going to need documentation. Oxandrolone, we don't prescribe it for weight loss. I've seen some of these places out here, they're prescribing Oxandrolone, which is Anavar. For weight loss. It's not for weight loss. FDA does not pr pr approve it for weight loss. It's not good as far as that goes. So we don't do that. There's got to be documentation. 
Nanjong, same way. There's got to be documentation. There's some things it's good for, but it's not for bulking. It's not for gaining mass. You know, I hear this all the time. And not just joints. You no. Know. All right. So that's what it is. Got mine in. Hot. All right. So definitely get it in. I want to see those costumes. All right. So November 1114, Cars and Couture 1920 theme. Great Gatsby. I can't wait. It's going to be awesome. It's for autism, great cause, right, as far as a charity. We're going to be out there, huge mansion, exotic cars, fashion show. What more can you ask for, right? It's going to be awesome. I can't wait. It's always a good time. It's our third year of doing this, so I'm really excited as title sponsor again. January 10th, Festivals of Speed, Benoit Park, St. Petersburg, more exotic cars. Titan Medical Center is the official media sponsor of Festivals of Speed. Uh, and the St. Pete is going to be awesome. It's out in Minoy Park, huge grass, a lot of area. Come out and join us. If you can't make it then, visit us down in Orlando, January 24th, for Festival of Speed at the Ritz-Carlton. That will be laid out there on the grounds of the Ritz-Carlton, which is huge, gorgeous property. We'll be there. Titan Nets will be there. And all these events, we'll have all that great Titan gear to give away for you guys. You guys can come up and talk to us, see what's up, take a picture, sign up for the newsletter. All right, and if you guys aren't able to get down here, you guys can always sign up for the newsletter and be a part of it. All you have to do is text the word Titan Medical to the number 22828. So 22828 is where you're going to put the numbers, and then you're going to text Titan Medical in the box as far as what you're going to write as the word. All right? If you do that, you guys can get a part of it. Okay, weekly poll. So the weekly poll keeps getting more and more... Um, traction it just keeps getting more popular so this one have you ever tried hercules potion it's a good one 42 percent said yes that is awesome so you guys know all the benefits you guys love it probably just as much as i do 40 percent said no wow that's really a split right there so most of the people said yes and most of the people said no and if you haven't tried it you really are missing out trust me i promise it is that much of a game changer for you guys. Uh, and then 17%, no, why should I? Well, I named all the benefits. If you're looking for better recovery, you're looking for better pump and blood flow, boost the immune system, helping liver functions, right? Lubricating joint areas, blood flow and weight loss, along with cramping and brain function, then Hercules Potion is something you need to definitely try. All you got to do, guys, is fill out the new patient paperwork, see the medical provider, very simple, very easy, over FaceTime or Skype. If you're not here, if you can come in here, it's like five or ten minutes, you're good to go, out the door, and Hercules Potion, you can order, and it can be yours. Guys, all you guys got to do, if you guys have any questions, concerns, you want to be a patient, call or text 727-389-3220. Check out the website if you want to, www.tightmedicalcenter.com. Keep it locked. Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, Twitter, and maybe even TikTok if it stays around, guys. Now, guys, if you guys want to catch this or any of my other episodes or even the ones with Titan Lifestyle Big Drew, you guys can always check out our podcast. Wherever podcasts are downloaded from, you can check there for Titan Lifestyle with me or me and Big Drew. So, guys... Been a great time talk Tuesday. I got to hurry my butt down to the polls so I can get my vote in, make it count. If you haven't done it, do it now. All right, guys. I'll see you guys next Tuesday, 6 p.m. for Titan Talk Tuesday. Don't forget me and Drew, Fridays at 2 p.m. with Titan Lifestyle. And every Sunday, Titan Medical Health and Lifestyle Show, Sunday, ABC, 11 a.m. here in Florida. So it's on cable. If you guys are not here in Florida, you guys can always check it out on YouTube or the Facebook Type Medical Center page. All right, guys. Have a great rest of the week. Tomorrow's hump day. Can't wait. Wednesday, we're already through majority of the week. I'll see you guys next week. Tuesday, Titan Talk. Guys, see ya.